Just being a celebrity could be a full-time job. You are always being watched. Each of your steps is tracked by photographers and, yes, sometimes it's more difficult than we can even imagine. They can't do things that the average person can. The job is definitely what makes stalkers attracted. They are constantly being judged and they have no privacy. At first, the experience of becoming famous provides so much ego striking. But sometimes we can't see the real faces of famous people and all we have is a huge collection of their street style photos. That's not different in the case of kids celebrities. So join us to see kids celebrities who are different off camera. Just a reminder about our new giveaway. We're giving away the new iPad Pro or the new iMac Pro. The choice is yours. All you have to do is watch the full video, leave a like, comment the keyword hidden in the video, and make sure you're subscribed. It's that simple. Number seven, Jaden Smith. Jaden Smith, the youngest son of Will Smith, lives life a little differently and so does his famous family. After all, when it comes to living the high life, no one does it better than Hollywood's elite. Jaden was thrust into the spotlight at a young age, but experiencing fame early on certainly had its perks. Jaden's life basically oozed glamour from the second he was born. Given that his parents are reportedly worth a combined $320 million, it's no surprise Jaden has experienced all the finer things in life. It was not uncommon for Jaden Smith to be brushing shoulders with Hollywood's hottest stars as a child. While most kids ended up in an office on Bring Your Kid to Work Day, Jaden ended up on blockbuster film sets such as those for the Matrix franchise. While most of our gifts as a child were teddy bears, while growing up, Jaden Smith was given Cartier jewelry. Actually, if you are a famous child, it doesn't matter what you were doing. Famous children have a verified Twitter tick that comes stapled to their birth certificate. And even if they spend all day tweeting inspirational quotes and Temple Run high scores, it can't be taken away from them. In 2014, Jaden made it clear that he is pretty much disappointing. His Twitter is sort of like those fake accounts that send out pseudo motivational speeches. As he says, I don't think I'm as revolutionary as Galileo, but I don't think I'm not as revolutionary as Galileo. Kiddo, first of all, Galileo was a mathematician, physicist, astronomer, and engineer, and he risked upsetting the church because he supported the theory that the Earth revolved around the sun. The word spoiled is not enough for this kid. He is considered to be a nuclear narcissist. Number six, Lil Tay. I'm only nine years old. I ain't got no license, but I still drive this sports car. Lil Tay is a foul-mouthed child rapper and rising internet star whose videos are viewed by millions. She has more than 1.8 million followers on Instagram, although describing them as fans would be a stretch. They mostly delight in heaping her with abuse in racist or crude terms that max her own lexicon. A 13-year-old girl is best known for bragging about how rich she is compared to other people and gaining controversy from immense YouTubers. Do you remember when you were a kid and you slipped up and said a bad word? You heard your parents stomping towards you, right? And you suddenly realized you messed up. But this little rapper has got a serious potty mouth, but for some reason, her mom doesn't seem to mind. The little lady even thinks that she's too cool to follow anyone back on social media. But we can't really solve the puzzle. Behaving like what is effectively every parent's worst nightmare, the world's youngest rapper tells her fans she's richer than all y'all broke ass haters. What do you think? Is something wrong with her parents? Number five, Jamie Lynn Spears. So they decided they needed to bring in the big guns. Them and stuff. Do you remember Zoe Brooks on the Nickelodeon sitcom Zoe 101? Yes, we are talking about Jamie Lynn Spears, who is the younger sister of singer Britney Spears. On camera, Spears was playing a sweet and innocent schoolgirl that won the hearts of her viewers. Surely she wouldn't be doing things only married people do because that would compromise Nickelodeon's clean-cut image. Spears was working towards getting out of her sister, Britney's, shadow when something rather unexpected came about. The whole planet was shocked when Spears announced that she was pregnant at the age of 16. Apparently, she was doing some pretty adult-related stuff in her spare time. Number four, Jojo Siwa. Jojo, 
Yes. Tonight, I think I'll be your fairy godmother. That's a good thing. Jojo Siwa seems to be at the height of her fame and success these days. Though she's been in the spotlight for several years now, thanks to her participation in a reality TV show like Abby's Ultimate Dance Competition and Dance Bombs, she's never been as big as she currently is. These days, the little lady has found success thanks to a brand partnership with Nickelodeon and a music career that caters to young children. But what do you think? Is her public persona fake? Some folks may find themselves bristling at Siwa's dynamic personality and might even think it's overblown forced and artificial. As the 2018 headline insisted, Siwa's shtick is not an act. Even Siwa explained it herself. My favorite thing ever is like, I love doing YouTube. That's what I love to do and that's my passion. That's who I am. She goes on to lament all those sad souls who suspect that she is fake or that Jojo is a character. But besides being fake or real, she did a horrible thing on one of her YouTube videos. Do you remember the vlog with her brother? It started with telling kids that her father was injured in an accident and how their father had been hit by a bus. They told the viewers that their dad was alive, but very injured, and it was like nonstop talking. But at the end of the video, it was found that they had lied about the incident. This caused a huge backlash against Siwa. Everyone was blaming her and that she did it just because she wanted more attention and views on the video and it doesn't really sound like an excuse. In fact, if that's true, it makes it even worse. She was even called a clickbait princess. Do you agree with that? Number three, Charlie D'Amelio. A teenage girl from Connecticut is today's most popular teenager, and who could she be if not Charlie D'Amelio? She has more than 88 million followers on TikTok, which makes her the reigning queen of the platform. But it's not enough. She is gaining more and more followers daily. She's always smiling in her videos, trying not to lose the vibes. Well, all she has to do is to smile and do some creepy moves that someone calls dancing. Okay, she seems to be free as a bird. She even has a hidden personality that she won't express on social media. The secret was revealed by her ex-boyfriend, Chase Hudson, also known as Lil Huddy. In an interview, Hudson was asked, what was it about her? And you won't believe what he said. Most people are comfortable around me, and the fact that she was shy showed a lot of character in her, and I was like, oh, this is like, genuine. It's hard to imagine that Charlie is shy in real life, isn't it? Maybe that's because she makes herself look as if she's the life and soul of the party. But could anyone imagine that she couldn't find enough confidence to put her content out there? and her friends were actually the ones who encouraged her to start uploading videos of herself despite her fans? Number two, Bella Thorne. I seem to remember somebody accusing me of being a human being. <laughs> you definitely remember Bella Thorne for her role as Cece Jones on the Disney Channel series, Shake It Up. She's actually one of those examples of someone who went from sweet and innocent to edgy and sexy. She was on the show when she was clearly in her early teens, while she was with Disney, she had a very clean image because that's what the company wants and expects from kids. But it seems like Thorne wanted to shed the good girl image and really show the world that she wasn't like her TV counterpart. She was caught partying it up in Hollywood when she wasn't even old enough to drink yet. Her Snapchat has been known to show off some selfies that weren't supposed to be something that a kid should have taken. Number 1. Honey Boo Boo freedom or cow poop can't really tell the difference right now here comes honey boo boo is an american reality television series that aired on tlc featuring the family of child beauty pageant contestant alana honey boo boo thompson while we have seen inside the honey boo boo house on numerous occasions it's hard to know what really goes on behind closed doors this little kiddo posted on facebook live video in which she is faking using drugs she pretended to snort cocaine just months after her mother was arrested on drug charges. It was a joke. Everyone is supposed to laugh about it. I wasn't trying to make fun of Mama's situation, Thompson said. But besides making fun of her mom, how does she even know what cocaine is? She was only 13 years old when she posted that video. Shouldn't 13-year-old girls play with Barbies? Okay, or making TikTok videos? But cocaine? That's something we can't really understand. Bad joke, Alana. Bad joke. What do you think about these celebrity kids? 
let us know in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and turn on your post notifications so you never miss a video from us. If you liked this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Just a reminder about our new giveaway. We're giving away the new iPad Pro or the new iMac Pro. The choice is yours. All you have to do is watch the full video, leave a like, comment the keyword hidden in the video, and make sure you're subscribed. It's that simple.